I have to say I really like this series. Maybe it was a bit slow leading up to the actual combat and war. And hopefully we'll get another series. I liked the opening. I liked how this went. The combat, the war, the characters. Just seeing how they all work together. And especially the main character who's sort of this protege. A good at strategy. The planning of the fights there are. How he turns a loss into a victory, how he makes up for his mistakes, how he learns what he needs to do. And the progression from the first episode to the final episode, I think, really worked well. It's definitely the kind of series I like. It's not just about fighting and war and combat, though there's a lot of that. But it's also about the characters. Each person has their own sort of plan, goal, aim where they're heading, what they want to do. And it really works well for me. Just seeing how each person progresses from the start to the end. The lessons that are learned. And it doesn't hold any punches. Things aren't always going to go well. And even when they do well, there's going to be costs. And that's what war really is. War isn't just simple things like a, like a video game. War is brutal and war is messy. And I think for the most part, this series did a really, really good job portraying this and just sort of showing how war can be. I'd like to know what you guys thought of it. Did you guys like this anime? What did you think of the characters? I thought each character was fairly good. You have the main character, you have the supporting characters, and each one had their place. And surprisingly, the one character I didn't hate is the one that shows up in the first episode. That's a bit of a surprise, but she was really good, I think. She she started out as the cliche, but by the end, you actually respect her. And I hope we see another season, because there's something planned for the next season, it sounds like, if they have one, and I, I'm, I can't wait to see it. So tell me what you think of it.